I'm Samantha Brown. For 20 years, I've been traveling the world. And the biggest lesson I've learned is that every destination, from a big city to a small village, has a soul. And there is an effort that goes into cultivating that soul, and that effort comes from the people. You're going to be in shape to play this yes, kind of music day in Yes, video. it happens to be, in my opinion, one of the greatest forms of aerobics. Uh, <laughs> four hours of nonstop pulling and pushing on these things can uh, take a toll on your body. And so when travelers say they want to go where the locals go, do what the locals do. When do we gossip? When do we not gossip? <laughs> <laughs> what we are really saying is, we want to be a part of that effort. You really want me to go? You will. Challenge accepted. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we want to share and connect with it in a way that makes us feel like we belong to this world. Keep your paddle nice and low, because when you bring it up high, you're going to drip all over yourself. Yeah, exactly. Woof! <laughs> Places to Love is about where travel connects us. That point where we forget about the past, take our mind off the future, and concentrate on being in the now. We'll have two hamburgers, three <laughs> large fries, and uh, two milkshakes, thank you. It's about the exclamation points of travel. Best day ever. <laughs> as well as the commas, because a comma is where a country a culture, a person, expresses themselves. And a comma is where we allow ourselves to breathe and observe. In an age where social media has begun to erode how we treat one another, travel is where we show up. So I'm not gonna be able to pick that up, Coach G. I'm just telling you right now. It's okay. Where we meet face to face and care about the other's experience. Places to Love is about creating a new list of must-sees by finding the people who are changing, challenging, and strengthening a destination to give us a refreshing travel experience. I feel like it takes people out of this desire to escape into a video game or their cell phones or the internet or TV and actually be in a space where they can touch and feel and sense. Whether it's food and drink, art and music, architecture and design. I'll take it. <laughs> this is why I have a love of travel and why these are my places to love.